Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski. Pivotal Game 3 of this playoff series tonight. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. And that goes off someone in front that doesn't reach the net. He was locked in there. He makes that save, and he had to look through the screen. I don't know what he could see except the backside of that player in front of him. And the puck's booted away. Moves it quickly over to Besser. There's a save. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. And that was Wade all the way. Wade heads up defensive play. Here's a feed in front. And that's intercepted. The Canucks will play it in their own end. Tape to tape pass is center. Sends it in front. Picked off in front. Puck sent over to Connor. Poked away in the neutral zone by Myers. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. To the front. Oh, gigantic save by Demko. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. We've still got zeros on the board. Vancouver's got it in the defensive zone. Ekman Larson's taking it from his own end. Moves it to Ronick. And that's broken up. Ehlers has the puck against the half wall. And now it's grabbed by Garland. Quick pass to Miller. They fight for it along the boards. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a pass in front. And that's stopped. The Jets gain control of the puck against the wall. Takes a whack but still hangs on. And now it's over to Ehlers. From the open ice, they gain the line. And he gets in front of that. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, what a slick stop by Demko. Demko's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. Oh, and that battle ends as the puck gets loose. Poked away at center by Perfetti. The Jets have it now. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Beauvillier. The Canucks gain control of it. Takes a shot. The Jets have it now. And he regains control of the puck. The Jets move it in. Quick feed to Krastov. Picks up the puck in his own end. Battling for it along the boards. Can't get a hold of that pass. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Jets get a hold of it. Lowry stick handling in his own zone. Winnipeg's got the puck. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. And he takes the pass. Vancouver's on the attack. Keeps hold of the puck. Here's a short pass to tries. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Quick shot. Oh, he gets a puddle on and he keeps it out. dangerous when he shoots pucks that are flat and settled on the ice. His snipe zone ability is that accuracy from having full control of the puck. Hellebuck's well respected and a great competitor between the pipes. Those are two players I'm going to watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Here in the late going of the frame, 
Still looking for our first goal. The frozen miss gets dropped, and we are back underway here. Has a chance in front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. On the one timer, and he'll likely puts it in for the goal, and the rookie is on the board. What a nice way to jump into your first playoff year. You get on the board, and you can relax a bit. The Canucks get a late goal here in the opening frame. I like the way they played the last couple of minutes here, and they're rewarded with the first goal of the game. Moves it around along the half wall. First period nearly in the books here. And that's turned aside. Moves the puck. The Jets looking against the half wall. Puck grab by Connor. Walker saving a good one by Demko. Oh, and another beauty stop right there. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Twenty minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather, and we'll come back with period number two in moments. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Ray, you're between the benches. How do you see things after that first period? Winnipeg's first period is nothing to write home about. I mean, they, they started slow. They got late into the physical aspect of the game, and they never had the puck. So when you don't have it, you got to chase it. They get behind, and now they got to climb out of the hole. Vancouver's going to play the puck from behind the cage. And now he moves it quickly to Pionk. The Canucks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Connor. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Shifley. Moves the puck along the half wall. Moves it to Dillon. They've had really good legs since the start of this period, and it seemed like a matter of time before they punched through. Quick pass to the Mesnikov. Couldn't make the connection on the play. And it's kicked away. Slips the pass in front. This is it off again here. His reflexes on display tonight. Picked up along the wall by Mikheyev. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Denies him with the pass. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. And now he moves it to Garland. Here's the pass. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Scrum along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Mateo. He carries the puck up along the wing. Angles it over to Stubica. Bang on passes center in the neutral zone. With possession along the wall. That pass doesn't go. The Jets move the puck in the defensive zone. Vancouver's got control of it now from their own end. Quick feed to Beauvillier. Moves it to the middle. And that's off target. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Knocked around but keeps it going. Gets the puck over to Niederreiter. Up along the wing. Can't make it work. Snaps one on net. And he gets a piece of that one and denies it. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Stedlitz won the draw deep in the defensive zone. And he takes the feed. 
Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Winnipeg's got the puck along the boards. Handles the pass. Oh, going wide! Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Here's a short pass to Drys. Great pressure with the stick. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. He's just playing the percentages in there. I don't think he sees this through that screen in front of him. But he's in the right spot and makes the save. Passes the puck over to Appleton. Here's a pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Pedersen's won the faceoff. Good fight for the puck along the boards. The Canucks scoop it up along the boards. Unable to reach that one. Vancouver's through center and now in the offensive end. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Eagle eyes by the referees. Delayed penalty coming up here. Looks like they caught the slash. And the play is whistled dead. And here's the call. Sometimes the sound your stick makes on the other guy's equipment is what sets the signal off. That's a slashing penalty. Well, this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. I scored about 25% of my goals on the power play. I made a living on it. One of the things, if you're on it, you better produce or they're going to make changes. The Jets have it behind the net. Moves it quickly over to Shifley. Takes the feed. Dubois got it in the offensive zone. And that was stopped. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Nice pass. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Winnipeg's got the puck against the half wall. Can't connect. Ekman Larson's lugging the puck. Moves it to Myers. Winnipeg's got the puck in their own end with time winding down. Score remains tied after the power play fails to deliver. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job, keeps this game tied. And there's the horn bringing an end to period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around.
centering pass in front, and that's stopped. The Jets gain possession along the wall. Gains the zone through the middle. Fires it. Oh, a clutch save. From the back of the cage with the puck. Oh, gets a paddle on it. What a stop by Demko. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Grabbed along the board by Besser. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Here he is in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Tries to feed it over to Connor. Nice feed. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And that's knocked away. The Jets have played the puck from behind the net. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. We got a tie game. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. And now he angles it across to Nemestikov. Huge stop by Tempo. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. McKayev's got the puck. Quick feed to Miller. Nothing doing. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if he can't get the puck at the goaltender. Taken by Ehlers. Shot! And that one's turned aside. And that's pushed away by Wheeler. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. It hasn't been boring. I mean, it's low scoring, but man, there's been a lot of chances at both ends of the ice. We've seen missed chances combined with great goaltending, and that gives you a low-scoring game. Puck dumped in. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. And he keeps possession. Here's a short pass to Perfetti. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. The Jets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Sends the pass over. Nina Rice's offense has been non-existent tonight. There's not many times you can say, I like the way they've been playing here, James. It felt like they were going to get a scoring chance. They get one, and they don't miss. Now they've got the lead. Winnipeg's close to the finish line, and they've got the one goal lead. Keep pushing. You've got the lead, but don't let it slip away by trying to be too conservative. Studnik has won the draw inside the neutral zone. Shot! Oh, what a save by Hillebuck! Shooters try to make it more difficult for the goalies by getting traffic in front of the net. He had to find it, and he did to make that save. The Canucks gain possession. Works it across to Niederreiter. Scooped up along the wall by Stenland. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Puck scooped up by Tries. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Winnipeg's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. From the boards, he takes that pass. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. From the blue line, they take control of it. Takes a shot. Grabs it with the glove. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Who had the better night? Carlin can stand by. Pedersen's been able to provide some offense in this matchup, guys, so I have to give him the edge in this one. Dubois got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Inside of the final minute here in the third. The Jets have it behind the net. And his oh. stick just imploded. Nothing you can do about it. You do everything right, and then your stick just collapses. A little back and forth. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Denied by Philip. Sharp reaction save. Slides the 
puck over to Connor. Poked away in the neutral zone by Pedersen. Fires it on net. There